Hi, in this video I'm going to go over how to change the images in your image slider in the front of your home page. You'll notice this is essentially the same thing as the old one. The arrows left and right look a little different and it only slides from left to right. It doesn't have any special transitions, but it's much easier to manage. I've already logged into the dashboard and then you'll see this blue bar down at the bottom that says try our new look. That's the only way you're able to manage a slider right now and you may just want to move to the new look um, exclusively. So to change your banners, you want to go to the Design tab. That's up there in the top right. And then you do Carousel and Social Media. And then here's where you'll see your five different slides. From what I can tell, it only supports a total of five slides. So you'll have to get rid of something if you want to add it. Um, on this first slide, I'll just click here. And if I want to add a heading, I'll just write Test. And then you can add some more text as well as a button. So you see this is if you want to really just make the image in GIMP and then you could use this little text builder to, uh, to add your captions or whatever you want to call them on top of it. You can also change your color up here. Uh, but what you might find easier is just to make the images as you want them in GIMP and just leave this all this stuff blank and it won't add anything. Um, what you will want to do if you want this slide to link somewhere, um, you're going to link it to one of your pages. So I don't know if there's a category or somewhere where you want to send um, the particular slide if someone clicks on it. If you don't enter anything then it doesn't link anywhere and that's fine too. I have it set at 8 seconds. Um, it would default it to 5. It seems to be moving a little quicker. You might want to bump this up to 10 or 12. Um, and I'll show you just clicking on this one. What not to miss. Costume Drilly. I'm just going to delete that one so I can show you how to add a new one. Um, so I'll do select for my computer. It says 980 by 450, but really that's still our same 956 by 408. That's still going to stay the same because I styled it the same way as our old one. We want to define what not to miss, I believe, was the one we missed. Let me just double check what the last slide was, what not to miss, yeah. So I'll select that one, I'll open it, it uploads, there it is, and basically all you do is click save and you're all set. Come back out here, you can refresh your page, and it looks like if I go back here, that was a slide you just added. So hopefully that helps you manage your carousel. Thanks.